boy, is it going to be an amazing time in October once they open up because they keep it temperature cooled just for you to enjoy yourself. Everything that you wanted in a theme park. Thanks for the field trip. Ooh, we could all that use today. that right about now. Right? <laughs> <laughs> During our field trip Friday theme park edition, we got a little taste of all the fun that's to be had at Great Wolf Lodge in Southern California, and that fun is coming to our valley. Yeah, we are only months away from having our own indoor outdoor water park when Great Wolf Lodge opens in Scottsdale later in October. So Gibby the Builder, Woo! Bob the Builder is out there right now. Love the hat, <laughs> giving us a nice inside look of what it's going to look like. Pretty cool, Gib. You know what? I could use that thousand gallons every three to four minutes right now, especially on a week like today when you have like what 110. Guess when this thing's open, who cares if it's 110? They keep it cooled to 84, nothing but water attractions. And let's say you say, well, I kind of don't like the water. It's okay. Wiley's thought of that too. He also has dry attractions as well to go along with you. Now, if you remember Wiley, Wiley's already thrown out the first pitch with the Diamondbacks. He's already hung out with us over in Anaheim, and now he's going to walk people through this great big theme park that's coming in October, just in time for people to celebrate. And remember, because its temperature uh, stays the same all the time, these folks are going to be able to enjoy it. Now, Brian Johnson, the GM who is joining me here. You know what? I, I try to give you a high five, but you said to me, nah, you know what we do here? We do a high paw. High paw. And high you know paw. what? A high paw to you. This is going to be a fun place for Arizonans and those who come to visit here. They're going to love this. We are so excited. This is the first indoor water park in the state of Arizona, and it was designed specifically just to reconnect families. So we have those special memories that are going to last a lifetime. That's what we do. We bring joy to families. You sure do. And now we gave them a sneak peek when we were in Anaheim, but what makes it different here is you have this adventure park, and this is going to bring so much fun that for those who, let's say you spent the whole day out in the water and you want to take a little break, you have something for them. This adventure park is just going to be amazing. 27,000 square feet. And what you're looking at is you're looking at Howler's Peak Ropes Course. We've got Rustic Ridge uh, Rock Climbing Wall. We've got Oliver's Mining that is also a sluice where they will learn how to mine and come up with their own uh, gemstones. We also have uh, Howl in One Miniature Golf, nine holes of golf, and then Ten Paw Bowling Alley and uh, a great uh, arcade called Northern Lights. You know, here's the one thing you guys don't see in all of this, and parents, I'm gonna let you know, there's bars in here. There's a place for you too. I know it's five o'clock somewhere. Parents, you're gonna love this place because the kids get to go off, have a lot of fun, do what they have to do, but what's gonna make this special is that yes, you see the big bucket like I got drenched on earlier, they're gonna have that for you. They're gonna have the awesome slides out here for you, but they're bringing something special, especially for us, and they are gonna show this off today. Let's see if you recognize this. Brian, that looks kind of like a snake to me. It does, and you look at the coloration was really designed to blend in with the Arizona landscape. And if you look at that centerpiece, what do you see? But a kind of diamondback serpentine design, and it's going to be called Diamondback Drop. And it's the first water slide of its kind in the world. Oh! I'm giving that a wolf call, bro. That is a high a, paw. That's a high paw. Let's have it getting ready for October. Wiley, let's get in here. Is there a dance we got to get ready for? Is there something that Arizona people got to get used to? Because well, we when can, this is we in. We can do our howl. Let's do, let's our, do howl. our howl. I will teach all you right, our howl. All right, let's do the howl. So it will it be a countdown of three, two, one, and then we will do stomp, stomp, clap, clap, and howl. Okay? All right, let's do it. Three, two, two one. one. Stomp, stomp, clap, clap. Oh! Oh, fall can't come fast enough. 